Hello everybody, today we are going to be taking a look at a reseller box from a consignment store. So let's get right into it. And welcome back. If you're new to my channel, I'm Charles, and together with my wife Angelique, we run a closet on Poshmark. It's called The Deacons. Um, links to everything will be in the description below. All right, now this is a reseller box from a local consignment store. Um, they've been selling pretty well, so my wife keeps getting them, and <laughs> that's about all there is to say. Um, if you want, go back to some of the older videos um, and find them and watch them, and you'll see some of the other stuff. All right. Now, I believe this box is mostly all one brand, one brand that does particularly well for us, and that brand is, is it right here? Free People. Uh, up first, we have a large Free People tunic, um, and this has just the little floral patterns, um, yeah. And it is a lighter color. Now, I know I said this in the past, in a past video, but um, I have been shooting the lighter colors just on the white background in the photo booth. Um, the dark background gets a little bit too much um, light reflecting, so it just doesn't look very nice. Um, so, with the lighter stuff, my wife just kind of photoshops the background to make it a little bit darker so the pieces do stand out, but it's easier to do that and get a good looking picture than to. Um, try to get no glare from the black background, um, which I don't even know how to do when there has to be light on the clothing, but not on the background. That's, this is not a booth video. This is a reseller box. So rather than babble about that, why don't I just continue? <laughs> Up next, we have a Delita. Um, this is a medium. It is new with tags, as you can see the anthropology tag right there. And this is a tank top. Tank top looks kind of maybe that's a skirt. I don't think it can't be a little high. Uh, we'll just call it a we'll just call it a tank top. Um, it's black. It has the has kind of a kind of a gold and blue plaid pattern. Um, hmm. This gold and blue were the colors of my high school, so that's actually, uh, if any, if anyone from my high school has a daughter or a midlife crisis and wants to buy this and have to see this video, um, look it up on our closet. <laughs> I doubt anyone will. I get, <laughs> I get one or two views per video. All right, up next we have a pair of Reformation Corduroys. These are also new with tags. Um, and they're a burgundy corduroy with a button fly. Um, so not something I would wear because I don't like button flies. It's like trying to undo a trying to crack a safe every time you gotta take your pants off. Don't like it. But, nice pair of pants. Sure, they should do just fine in our closet. Alright. Up next, we have a Bowden. Um, this is not new with tags. It does have the uh, tag from the Simon store on there, but I'll just have to cut that off. Um, before I shoot it, that is quite the busy shirt. It is pink, blue, red, white. It's got a. Okay, this a little busy, but uh, very breathable, and should do should do nice in the warmer weather. Um. I do know that we have, uh, some of these have been shot, some of them haven't. Um, one piece actually sold uh, that was shot, so 
I'll get to that at the end of the video. Um, all right. Up next, we have a keepsake. Uh, this is a large. This is a keepsake dress. Um, and like most dresses, it has kind of a vague, vaguely flower pattern on it. Um, it's kind of like a neon light flower pattern, so not really a... I don't really know what that art style would be called, uh, but where it's just kind of outlines. Um, they're all over the place. I don't know. Another another nice dress. I'm um, given that given that the pieces of these that I have shot already, um, and I'm probably gonna shoot the rest of them after this video. But given that we've already had interest and already sold a piece, and I haven't even finished shooting this yet, I'm pretty happy about it. Um, if I'm giving a little spoiler on my final thoughts. Okay, up next we have a free people. Um, a knot. Oh well. What would this be called? Um, I always forget the term for this. Uh, leotard, I guess. But it's kind of weird because it's got this uh, kind of knot or wrap in the front. Uh, so let's see if we can get... Uh, is that showing up in the light? Yeah, you can kind of see it. Yeah, there. And I also should mention that this is new with tags. Um, intimately. So, it is a free people leotard with a open wrap front. All black. And once again, my excessive lack of knowledge when it comes to what items of clothing are actually called comes into play. Now, I should just, I should just call everything top or bottom. And I know there was at least one other piece of free people in here that did sell. Um, there might be more. I'll have to check the list because this was this seven. There's eight on the list, and I know one thing sold. All right, and lastly, we have an Amanda Up Richard. Up Richard, and this is just a orange dress. Um, it is sleeveless. Uh, it does have these buttons that are. Just for show, because I don't really think they adjust anything. I mean, they do actually come... They are actual buttons, so they're holding like a little flap of fabric to the uh, to the shoulders there, but they don't actually tighten anything. They don't actually strap anything. So, just for show. And, um... Oh, those are drawstrings in the front. Not, those, those actually do work. Uh, but no pockets, so just an orange dress. All right, and last but not least is the thing that sold, and that would be this. <laughs> Which side? Do? Let's see. There we go. This is a free people down top. Uh, let me look here. Uh, See if I can find exactly. Ah, it is a free people short sleeved tunic. Um, so it's kind of a uh, purple. I'm looking at a picture of it. It's got lines going across, and um, I always do this. You can't see my hand when it's up here behind the picture. Need to stop that. Oh, uh, well, you can see all the lines and zigzags on it, and uh, that sold for um, an amount that um, I can look up and put. Maybe below the picture, right there. Um, anyway, um, given that I shot stuff and it sold pretty fast, um, I'm happy. And there has even been interest in the few things that I have shot. I just have to finish up the second half of this box. Um, I was shooting some stuff last night, and I had a little. I got done pretty quick, so I got started on this box. Um, got about most of the way through it. Um, gave that to my wife to put up, and that's... Then stuff sold and stuff has interest, so... <laughs> oh, I really need to shoot these videos more consistently so I can keep my... Keep my, um... 
Mojo? Let's say Mojo. So I can keep my video recording Mojo going, and I don't get as rambly. All right. Um, so happy about this box. I um, think everything should sell just fine. Um, paid a little bit more for it because it's a consignment store, but stuff sells pretty quick from these, so I'm not too worried about making our money back and then some. All right. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, share, subscribe, and comment. And next time, until next time, I'll see you. Thank <laughs> you.